The Italian system not be the problem. Now our mindset be the issue. We love to play that victim. And we as Nigerians, we are not born to play victim. We are born to survive. We are born to be great. Anywhere to find ourselves, we are born to be great. Italians no like us. Italians like to favor their people. Italians, they are the arrow world. Italians are not good people. This is what this Nigeria guy. They talk. Last week, give my husband because waiting in the hope for, waiting in the wish for, in the expect, the main reason why he come Italy, he never achieve them. Hello, my amazing, wonderful, better, sophisticated process. I'm back again on a beautiful screen, like I never left. If that just make any sense, as always. May we tell Almighty God, the God of determination, striving, focus. Thank you for another day. Will make me and you to see God. It got this mind. Uh, I need to wash my hair. All right. Last week, this guy see my husband. He began to complain. Okay. This guy came in seven, eight years ago. Now he confirmed Italy. So since then, up to now, things are not going well. You get ups and down, everything. Wish a normal thing for everywhere. You know, many of us were there for Italy over 10, 20, 30 years. We are still facing our own one or two challenges here and there. A normal life day, stress for everywhere. So when they talk this thing, I just they corner the listing. And they pay attention to his tone, his body language, his eyes, and everything in general. And they come for a place of bitterness and H A T E. You get towards the Italo people. My God was a giver inspiration, everything as small, small like that. It was just so pissed. You can tell in the conclude say they are not good people. Now, this now waiting, push me, come make the video out here. Not to gossip behind a guy with a complaint about the system of this country because waiting they wish for, he never see her. I want to use this story to take encourage we as Nigerians where they migrate from Nigeria and go Western world. They come Italy, Germany, Spain, America, UK, Canada. Anywhere at all, you they go for Western world. Are you they go there with the aim of surviving, with the aim of Henry, give you your unborn children, your children, your parents, your sleepless, the better life you dream of. I want to encourage all of us be inclusive. Now, when it comes to partiality, favorizing, favor, favor, favorizing, okay, yeah. And when it comes to tribalism, when it comes to this arrow, it is for every, including Nigeria, inside Nigeria. Yeah, including we as Nigerians, me and you. You get it there for everywhere. You will see Igbo Mag won't give Igbo Bora first a job before you give another tribe for Nigeria. Minding not if the other tribe they competent to acquire or to get that position, they don't care. Once you are not an Igbo man, it could be the least of their preference if I'm communicating, you get. I recall back there for Nigeria, our landlord back there, if you not be a tribe, it will hardly give you house rent for that compound. Ah! Unless, eh, <clears throat> Who bring you come like who you really, really know, like, respect, if they add. What you want to call that one? Favor, favor, favorism and tribalism and partiality, you get it. So it's there for every year. Now, here is it. There is one thing I want to encourage us, where the base for Western world, where the base for Italy. I love to use Italy as a beautiful case study because here we get serious language barrier. Or like you go for America, UK, Canada, they're just English-based country. But if you come like France, 
Spain, Germany, Italy, they, they speak different languages. Say they add for a common, ordinary, simple Nigerian guy or gay or person to adapt smoothly into the system. For a place like UK, Canada, Australia, America, or a English-based country, yeah, you might not um, be speaking that fluent, current, quaint English, English, but go, come, how are you? Fine. What's your name? You know, you could adapt. Cash up, understand. You get all like, yeah, Italy. Now, there is one thing I want to make we as Nigerians understand me say, we must stop playing the victim card. Come on. We must stop playing the victim card. You knock on one door, they're not open. Go to the next door. Yeah, you know they easy. We all don't get our own fair share of no, not you. That we don't get that. You get me. We say I did it like this. I don't get my own fair share of you will black and I'm going to employ you. Or I go drop my CV for somewhere and I will even leave the place. Don't tear and trust inside us be like I see her. What have you done now? We move. It did every bit. Would that stop me from knocking the next door? No. Because if we get this mindset of say, ah, they don't like us, so they don't want us, so it's gonna weigh you down. Like it go hard for you to grab opportunity when you will see one. Okay, say, ah, if I go, say any need, you understand me now. So, so not let all this, they don't like us, <clears throat> they don't want us. Be clad your sense of judgment, your sense of reasoning, and make you lose on potential possibilities if you see off your front eventually. You must be willing to accept no. Take no. Say, ah, you know what be here? Okay, I go to the next place. Surely, you will see who will accept you just the way you are. Just keep knocking and be prayerful. All this, your anger, your hatred, your this, it will lead you nowhere. You cannot fight the system. If you get out, or you see a man will get the house, see, don't give the house to black Nigerian. There is nothing the government can do about it. Now you get the house, or a owner of a company, you don't employ you. There is nothing you can do about it. You understand? Just keep knocking until you see that one person will go accept you. When it comes to looking for a job for anywhere at all, all you need is just one perfect job, one good job. You can say 200 CVs, 1 million CVs. All you need is just one job to stop searching. When all you need is that one place to accept you and start working and making a living. Yeah, you will knock so many doors, kiss many frogs. Of course, now not a part of life. But don't let that one stop you from searching. Many of us, with this bitterness towards them, whereby if you see a nice Italian person, what did that, what did that, what did that, what did you you can't tell the judge this person. I believe in, I won't see how you go treat me for me to conclude on your personality. Now you go ask for me to take what he and that person tell me say that person no good do no I'm not happy to do me bad they are gonna draw my lines okay not true or not like because all oh, that person no like my my destiny ever my destiny see you can you never can tell she stop playing this arrow card victim card oh because I'll be black oh you know like no. Many of us will find opportunity, but we have nothing it takes to grab one, to accept, to take one. And I'll come and make several videos again and again. In the course of you waiting to get a job, go and equip yourself, empower yourself, easy the language, do any small, small, minor course, improve yourself that little way you can. So when you see opportunity, you more be prepared to grab it. You get. I don't see who that because ordinary Tesla media not give him a good job, or the RB the B will not course. 
do something. Ah, join your CV. You feel not get the working experience, but go and do something to enable you get something to put for the table. I get this one first for my aunt. I'm going to get more if I have the means to get it. Don't sit down for grand. They lick your wound. They worry your in self pity. Oh, not love me. Hey, yankily, yankily, yankily. Don't do that. And most importantly, who you they flow with for this country? Go determine your destiny, your life. If all your circles, all your friends, they are not motivated to uplift their self. For example, you as a gay, you call this it, for example, all the women you flow with are all road workers. He go hard for you to break out from that circle. Or all your party as a guy now, white father carriers, he go hard to break out from that circle. Or all your friends now, all the bomb, 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 open on the government, he go hard for you to break out for that cycle. You must have a mind on your own on what you want for yourself and go towards it. Even if they really laugh you, oh, see that one, no, if they, no, they change, if they go work for Parika, if they don't worry, or if they go to school, go to course, just focus like that. I recall a few years ago, I do my, my uh, nursing, nursing, nurse course. You got this fine girl, you just see me. Ah, they are skinny, you know, nah. See, ah, you just did so fine, no? Why you come Western world? Can't you go do course? Can't you go school? Like, see your mates are just cashing out, making money, everything. I be like, I know what I want for myself. I have this goal on how I want my life to go past this country. And I'm working towards it. It's not easy, but I know I will get there. Fast forward to a few years along the line. This same person, they called me to go on EPA, right? A uno exam, the basic of them all, because you won't put in for certain documents. So tell me, if I not ignore all those side noise, focus on my education, focus on learning my my oldest language, on improving myself. How will she call me to assist her, or I should just give that kind of? Advice, I don't say that true too. You are right too. I just dump me and she go for the same circle, the same place till tomorrow. So in life, you must know what you want for life. I will go towards it. You will work like you must work towards it. I always say, learn to leave the crowd and take your own shovel, dig your own road, and see where it will lead you to. Sometimes, if not all the time. The success to journey, not lonely one. Not lonely one, but you must wait to go alone. Like, go alone. Let nobody discourage you, distract you, to lose focus. No, focus. Because you know what you want. This course, last three years, go for it. Oh, three years old. It, you don't do a more. You do, you do. You do a three years, you don't call something else. Which one is better? You understand? Always learn to improve yourself, equip yourself. You need a fine job or you don't get a small job, go and get your driving license. Now and look at open door for you for better job. All these small, small things will end up your life living in the Western world. They cool, smooth, perfect. Try to get it one after the other. It's not be easy, I know, but it's not impossible. We they complain again and again and again. But what are you doing to better yourself? Nothing. Not only a dumb man who do something, the same thing again and again and again. They expect different results. Impossible. can't. You they complain. Oh my God. Oh no job. Oh this. Oh that. What are you doing to better your tomorrow? Absolutely nothing. No knowledge is waste, and not to invest in yourself will be useless. In one way or the other, it will always come back to pay you a good result. 
As soon as they complain again and again, oh, this is my job, oh, it's not good, oh, this job, oh, oh, the pay is too small, oh, this, I want more pay. But what are you doing to change that narrative? Absolutely nothing. The next five years, see, they're complaining. Without doing anything at all to change it, it's time to stop. Sometimes, you know, all the time, the Italian system not be the problem. Now, our mindset be the issue. We love to play that victim. And we as Nigerians, we are not born to play victim. We are born to survive. We are born to be great. Anyway, after we find ourselves, we are born to be great. See other African countries that they inspire to be like us. They know we they know what we carry. We are all Zolas, irrespective of where we find ourselves. We are always a push, we always survive. So let's stop playing the victim game. They're not like us. No, dust your slippers, tighten your sleep, and look at what to do to change that narrative. Our mom will stop being entitled. There's one thing that irritates the living air out of me. Now that entitlement spirit. I come here, they must help me know. Even our own people, they struggle. They suffer. I don't go find job. They take me. But they let the Italian woman go. Me and she apply for the same job. They take me. They allow her go because they see my potential. They say, I am willing to work, willing to learn, willing to fail, and willing to learn from my mistake. I accept criticism. I'm not doing well. Okay. Ah, excuse me. Okay, okay. Grazie. Grazie. Mille. Oh, wow, that. You get. I not play tantrum, 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 tantrum. Okay. Block attack. I don't cry, I don't frown, I don't squeeze, nothing. I smile. I take out the pitch of salt. I smile and I improve on what I'm doing. Nobody won't let you know what they do. Go. No. We won't keep you. So in as you are doing, try to be your best in that field. Work on, your, on yourself. Improve yourself. I made the best out of it. We are Nigerians. We are Ozolas. We are survivors. That's what we are made for. We are made of. You get? That's what we are made of. Lastly, don't forget to be prayerful. For the Bible said, anywhere you put your footstep, I have given it unto you. So, Anywhere at all you find yourself, Italy, Germany, Spain, France, what have you? Know this, say God put you there for a purpose. Ask God, what is my purpose? Lord, help me. And when praying, you must put in the work. When praying, be active. And be humble. Not let pride, the Bulgarism. Oh God, he blesses small small nest. You want much of a Nigeria person head pass. You want shit there. You want to do this. No. Be humble. The Bible says, humble yourself and I will lift you up. The, you got this beautiful uh, story where they shaping me day by day. About the donkey where carried Jesus go. I think now Kena. Yeah. So this donkey now carried Jesus Christ go to this city and they dress the donkey. In all of this process, this donkey was faithful, was humble. All like they don't put the first cloth. Oh, all right, all right, yes, I don't dress fine. No, he was humble. Imagine who will carry the master. He was humble. Finally, they don't dress our way. Finally, Christ don't sit on top of this donkey. They're going to go their journey. When they reach this city, everybody put in their best cloth for ground, red carpet, everything. Guess who match the cloth pass? This ain't donkey. 
not be Jesus Christ because he stay on top of the donkey while that royal convoy, that red carpet, and the donkey may step on it majestically to the end. Wait, I won't try to talk. Many of us as human beings, that small decor, that small dressing, God, they give us more small blessing. Here come the pride. Here come the arrogance. Here come the, do you know who I am? Do you know who I am? I will deal with you. Humble yourself because God is just starting with you. Don't let pride steal the main blessing from you. So in all you do, be humble. In all you do, not try to match another person's head. In all you do, not look down on anybody because you know one thing? Who you they look down? Who you they underestimate? You they come alive. Ah, this one. Ah, baggy. No call a person off with God never even starts with. That person you they come alive. Ah, a person. Ah, you not reach me. When their growth go come. You might be shocked alive. And if you are not strong, cardiac arrest might creep in because they are growth, eh? It will blindfold you. Be humble. Oh, you don't know, feel happy. Wish them well and pray for them and go your separate way because you cannot help everybody. But not look down anybody at all at all. We all came here to survive. Oh, you feel happy. Help. You don't help. Wish them well. Pray for them. Be humble. So many pride everywhere. Nigerian man, Nigerian woman. They get a small position. The next thing you go see a man. Lots of the counselor for the small city for eight years. The next thing you go see all the new, new immigrant guests. Promise them nothing. Camera is a freaking bitch. Let's be guided. So guys, so. If you find work for Italy, you won't survive, it's not going well, no worry. All will be well. We all got one fair share of the hard life for this West. Our life is hard, though. Oh, God. Life is hard. You get it? Life is hard. It takes the grace of God Almighty to put through. So brace up yourself and let God do the rest. So, guys, just to encourage somebody out there, say, we will stop playing this victim race, victim card, not like us, not like us. No, come on. We are more than that. Have a beautiful day. Toodles.